Hello, hello people, and today I would like to show you how to install BlueStacks platform to play your favorite games on Macintosh computer. Well, this is my Mac OS Catalina version 10.15, and there are a few easy steps has to be done. BlueStacks.com website, download. Once you finish downloading, double click on the icon and start extracting it. It may take a few minutes, but you will not find any problem here, for sure. The first problem you may face is that your operating system doesn't want to open it because it's downloaded not from Apple Store. Then you have to select this radio button. Next step, you have to go to Privacy tab and uh, open Privacy to get access with your local operating system password. Then scroll down to get to BlueStacks and put check mark. And that's it. The hardest part is done. Then you have to continue your installation. But mine stop here because I already installed it, as you can see on this image. Once you completely install it, load this BlueStack 4 platform. It may take a couple minutes. Here's a millions of games, but we are looking for some specific one. Go to search and start searching. Once you get it, just in because I don't have controller right now, I am gonna use this keyboard for first time because I just ordered this controller. This one, Steel Series Nambus Bluetooth mobile gaming controller from Amazon. This blue stack has own preferences where you can change your resolution in the DPI. Actually, I try many times to change resolution and every time it's restarted, but it will always stay the same. But DPI, I able to change it to maximum 320. And of course, I recommend you to do this maximum. As well as CPU score, I put six, default was four. And uh, memory, I try to change it every time when it's restarted. It moved back to this number and the rest I think it's not very important. And now I want to introduce you a short play how it's look on my screen and uh, let's load this game and then you can see how it works. And good luck to you with your computer and with your installation. And if you have any question, feel free just uh, put it your question or concern on comments. I will happy to help you.